Hey everyone, Mary here. We're back at the wonderful world of Sim Airport and Squeaky Chair. Sorry about the chair squeaks. Um, so we're back, and I had a great, great suggestion. Build a restaurant. It's a great suggestion. So I had a suggestion to uh, take this out, all this ticket, extra ticketing that we have, and put in a restaurant. Let me see if I can. By the light of Zeus. I bet I can't. Zeus doesn't have a light bulb. He keeps throwing it at people. They're like, hey, Zeus, what's up? And he's like, light bulb to your face. I was trying to see if I could find out who gave me the comment because I cannot remember because I'm lame. Two seconds, two seconds. Two more seconds. Seven more seconds. Sort of like two, but... Not quite. Psychopain, that's who it is. Why I don't remember that, I don't know. But Psychopain gave me an excellent suggestion. Shrink the ticketing area and make a little restaurant. So that's what we're going to do because I have a bank. And um, I like having banks made of money. All right, so there's our ticketing section. Much smaller than it was. So we want to build a kitchen area and it's gonna require stuff what's it gonna require it's gonna require a cooker it's probably gonna require a sink kitchen sink right next to the cooker is there a, yep prep cart let's let's give them room to prep like there two prep carts Uh, I'm not worried about that. So there's our kitchen. All right, so we need we need to put doors in and walls and all that good stuff. So let's go to our. I I don't know what I don't know what the hell that was. I just started going. Bup, bup, bup. All right, so door wall window window walls so we can look in there and see if if you know they're dropping the food on the floor and pooping in the cereal i don't i don't know <laughs> God, that sounds terrible why would i think that why why would my brain go to pooping in the cereal i don't know here we go boom door all right, so the next bit is going to be going to need a cash register. <coughs> Excuse me. So how do we want to do this? Well, you gotta have the, the chef's table. And then, this is wall, so. Chair. Chair. Wall. That actually doesn't work, but we're gonna leave it like that anyways. Because I can cancel cancel we're just wasting money at that point man those are expensive I thought that was a thousand dollars for a chair I was gonna be like shut your mouth Like it's a weird sitting situation, okay? I I don't make the rules here. All right, there's our chairs. Our cash register is going to be here. We'll have two of them. Those are some those are some shitty tables. 
<laughs> Let me tell you. Alright. Um, gonna need a bunch of food workers to make this happen. But that'll be alright. We can do that. Walls. Windows. Cancel that. There we go. Objects. Flight information display. And I'm out of money. Okay. That's good though. This is our this is the this is a good start. Wait, I have a big loan, don't I? Hmm. I can't afford five thousand dollar payment right now. Well, that's gonna suck. We can't even open this place until we get our food workers hired, so I don't know why you're sitting here. We're closed. Close it did. Alright, so... My door is installed very strangely. I wish I could install it. But I can't. That cost me $250. That's great. Zone? Kitchen zone. Whoop. I need a pizza oven and a refrigerator. I didn't even see a pizza oven. Alright, well it's not that big. We can put one in there next to the prep cart. And refrigerator. Can put one in right there. Not enough money. Okay. So those are going to be expensive. But we should be able to do that. Soon. How much is this? Yeah, we can do that after that guy takes off. Boop. There we go. Okay. So that's done. Zone. Cafe zone. Okay. And this is assigned to kitchen and... Time to kitchen. All right. One, two, three, four. Four food workers. Kitchen's open for business. Uh, sell that. This way, people don't have to wait too long. They may be waiting too long. There we go. We've got a ton of staff now who can, can handle everything. We should be able to make some serious bank. Oh, we have some missed flights here. Um, I don't know why we've got missed flights. Apparently there's a demand for ATMs. Um... Why are you just sitting there? It it appears that nobody's getting on these planes. I don't know what's going on. I don't know why that plane got stuck. But it did tank my happiness quite a bit. Wait, I don't know what you said. You were going too quickly. We'll have to watch for other speech bubbles. No staff. For what? What are you saying there's no staff for? There's like four people there. 
I have five people at each station. I don't know. I don't know what they were saying no staff about, but there's there's plenty of staff there. Okay, We've got eleven thousand dollars. We're going back to objects. We're gonna plorp down. Um, where's ATMs? They're gonna be in the A section, aren't they? Yep. Gonna plorp down an ATM there. Gonna plorp down an ATM here. And that's going to help people be like, oh, I can get money. And I can just be like, yes, you can. Get you some money. Tell that. Alright, so now they can get a nice snack. Damn, you ate that pizza fast, kid. Some people just seem to be sitting there and not and leaving before they get their food. I don't know. We'll just let it go. I don't think I need more people, but maybe I do. There's a lot of tables. All right, so we're going to watch this guy. They're boarding just fine. going to watch this guy. Almost everybody's in line, so they're doing good, too. What's your problem? Kitchen has no inventory. What? Say what now? Do I have to order food? Or does it get delivered? Kitchen storage. Hmm. Okay. Well, this needs to be five by five for us to have um, storage. So we're going to do some storage in here. One, two. So I need to be there. Yeah. So I need to go like Foundation to here. It's gonna cost me six grand. Let's just go ahead and start. We'll get it in just a second. There we go. So we'll let them put that foundation in. We'll expand this out, get our storage up and running. Um. Clear these walls. We'll clear those walls. Beautiful. Perfect. Put our normal cross flooring in so we can afford that. Um, zone storage. Okay. Now we need to go into objects. Throw in a couple storage shelves. How do I get more inventory from my kitchen? What do, what do I do to that? Requires pizza oven. Pizza oven's right there. Restocks daily at 12. I need more refrigerators. So we're going to need like a line of... We're going to need a freezer room basically if we're going to be feeding people throughout the day. I didn't realize it would re it wouldn't restock automatically like that. Shit. Okay. We're boarding, so that's good. Uh, 
Are, have my pizzas been delivered? Yes, they have. We now have 100 pizzas. Okay, so we're going to... We're going to expand this out and put in a shitload more freezers. That's what we're going to do. That's a $9,000 expansion. 11000 We're We're going to make it a big old, big old freezer section for our kitchen. Put in a couple more prep carts, too. So we'll let them build that out. I mean, we, we can afford to do this. We can afford to, to make these, uh, deal with these expenses. Zone, we're going to do... Oh, that's interesting. If I do that, they stop because I don't have a two-lane road because I haven't researched two-lane roads yet. My current daily interest has gone up. It actually went up. I was like, lower interest rates, and it went up. Lovely. So I need road building, which is insufficient funds. Fair enough. All right, clear out these walls here. Thank you. You're, what do you mean you're not in an enclosed space? There. We do want to put our floors in. Those floors just look ugly. It's an easy $750 to spend. Um, let's put in two more prep carts. Okay, so they can use those. And then we're just going to put in freezers. A refrigerator, sorry. Alright. That will give us way more inventory than we need. At least right now. I mean, that's one... Two, three, four, five, six hundred pizzas. If we're selling six hundred pizzas a day, I'll be pretty damn happy. You're boarding. You're going to actually depart on time, too. That's nice. Boom. On time departure. He only paid $400. Whew. We are in the hole, baby in the hole but we'll get out of it because now we have all the pizzas we could ever need and that's actually making me quite a bit of money why aren't they talking oh they're just going in and sitting they're not actually ordering anything now they are there we go you want some early morning pizza? Some breakfast pizza? Have at it. 280 bucks. I mean, it's not offsetting our expenses or anything. Staff's costing more than that, but... You know. You do what you can. We'll, we'll be getting some... Some shelves here. Once we actually get back into the red. And we'll get there. I mean, we've already knocked off two grand out of, out of our, our red functions. We'll get some chips and stuff. ATMs are rocking it. No staff. Dude, how many people do you think I need working there right now? So it is a case where they've walked away to, to prep somebody's food and... They're just like, all right, new staff, huh? It's 
So I need staff, basically. Can't afford them. I mean, I want to, but I can't afford them right now. So our pizza inventory is just getting slammed right now. Pretty sweet. And we're in the green. All right. What was that called? Kitchen storage. It's only 500 bucks. It's going to add even more options to our menu here. Let's drop in a couple of more workers. I think it's going to allow us to sell more faster and avoid that no staff mm, looks that we've been getting. All right, so we got 3,300 right now. We're midday. We still have a lot of planes left to, to fly in, so... All right. Yeah. Back up to six grand, we can afford our interest payment. Never mind, all of our shit just restocked. And that is expensive. We can afford half our interest payment. And we're still getting that no staff. We'll work it out. Now we can afford our interest payment. <laughs> now we can really afford our interest payment. Satisfaction's up. Income is good. We lost money there. Income is not as good as it needs to be. Our staff is just real expensive. But I honestly think we have as many people as we need for this. 13,000. If I can get up to 50 grand, I'm going to pay part of this loan off. So we're not going to spend any money for the next couple of days in this game. Aside from what we're spending out just to operate the damn thing, of course. These people miss their plane because they're just stuffing their faces. I'm just going to laugh at them because they're stupid. There's our little prop plane, bringing in a little bit of extra income. We have two days of interest payments and staff money. Just about. Here comes our interest payment. It's going to be six grand. The loan is what's keeping us from being in the, in the black permanently. So as soon as we can clear that out, we'll be doing a lot better. I mean, we are running airline uh, airplanes through here almost 24-7 right now. And we'll begin planning out our next expansion to get another runway in, another set of planes in sometime soon. I want to get dual roads in first. Okay, we're at 20,000. I'm about to drop down to 14. In about two hours. Not bad. Not bad, though. Our income is not bad at all. We still got to get floors in there, but again, I'd like to pay half that loan off before I do that. There we go. That bank loan interest to fourteen thousand. We gotta do that like five more times. I can actually sack a couple of you guys. Alright, so we sacked one. 
That'll save some money tomorrow. It did cost me $100 in severance pay. But hey, you know what? He's earned it. He's built this airport with his bare hands, he and his friends. I appreciate that. Just can't afford you right now. Hire you back when I can. So we got donuts and chips and crisps. <clears throat> Depending on what side of the pond you're from, of course. And pizzas. Breakfast pizzas and whatnot. No staff. Mer. Mer. Go to the fucking vending machine if you can't wait. Alright. That. Okay, we need to be making more money than this. Fifty grand to pay down on this loan. That that's a pretty big ask. That's a pretty damn big ask. I need to look at my detailed financials. I wonder if I can do that reports. Uh, profits and loss. Today. So we are losing money. Yeah, that $6,000 banknote is what's keeping us down. We've been making three grand a day if if that were if that were not here so we did we actually made three grand yesterday all right think we can fit one more flight in I have time for an afternoon and an evening flight all right, let's see do we have a nighttime flight that we can bring in. Not a whole lot of people are interested right now. Alright, so we got one night flight that we can bring in. Let's get that bad boy scheduled properly in the appropriate nighttime slot. That gives us a nice boost. So now we just got to get people out of here, cycle them out, make some money. We need 20 more grand, 26 grand in order to be able to uh, make a payment on our loan. I really don't want to change anything. I would like to add another uh, scanning station here just get that many more people through but I'm not sure I can actually afford it I mean I, I have the money for it obviously come on just 10 more grand and I'm gonna push the button and reduce my interest Well, as best I can, obviously. Ooh, we've got a huge pileup at this this ATM machine. It's going to cause some problems. We've got a missed flight there. Yeah, we're starting to see some cracks. Some cracks are forming. Another missed flight. Another missed flight. They're getting held up in places. The ATM's one of them. Definitely going to need to put another ATM or two in. Man, the ATM is actually bringing in quite a bit of money, too. That's kind of nice. We may be able to, to make it. We'll go in the red, but I'm okay with that. That restaurant turned out to be a really decent investment, too. That should get me close to 48,000. We should have another flight coming in or two. Actually, it looks like three more flights. Okay. 
there's fifty thousand. Decrease my loan. Three thousand dollars in interest. Fifty thousand dollars in the bank. All right. We'll go on the red a little bit, but I don't. I don't much care. Because we can overcome that three grand every day very easily. We won't even be two grand in the. And actually, we may be in the in the black the whole time. That'll be awesome. Come on, we got one more plane coming in, right? No, that's tomorrow night. What are you doing? Just chilling. All right. There's our last flight for the night. So we we did not go into the into the red. That is that is wonderful. Holy crap, we have a profitable airline now. Wow. I mean, it, wow. <laughs> if we go look at our our reports here and look at our profit and loss for the day, we didn't lose as much as I thought we would. Um, day 24, we lost 15,000, but I paid back on my loan, so that's not going to be too bad. If we come back and we look at today, right now we're in the hole because we haven't, haven't had any flights come in, but as soon as flights start coming in, that P&L will change. We may have another positive day, which will be fantastic. First flight that comes in is going to wipe out our negative balance right here. All right. Second flight comes in. We're only losing 1500 see? We've got a profitable airline. Just got to bring the planes in, push the planes out. Next flight that comes in will bring us flush. We should have, like, one more coming in. Well, unless it's a puddle jumper, then it won't bring us flush. Okay, next flight. Is it, these are my two puddle jumpers. See? In the green. In the green. So if I actually don't do anything and just let this ride, we're good. We're, we can make as much money as we want, but of course we want to we wanna stress this system out. We want to push this baby to the limit. We want to get fifty thousand more dollars so I can decrease this loan, um, and just have an extra three grand in my pocket every day. But that loan did a lot for us. It allowed us to to do a lot of expansion, and and clean up and planning that we weren't able to do without that loan. So I'm not upset about that at all. Let's go ahead and have them put our proper floors in. That's an eleven fourteen thousand dollar floor. How far can we get with just like eight grand? Oh, well we can We can put that much flooring in. And then that much flooring in. Alright, our floors are put back in. Holy shit. Look at that. This is going to be nice. Woo. Um, security zone. We're just going to go ahead and line that out so it looks right. Thank you. Perfect. Now, you know, the aesthetics do play quite a big role in in our airports functioning so we're gonna want to start putting some plants and shit in here that should make some people happy our lack of benches also doesn't help I bet people in real life wish you could build uh, or lay floors that quickly. 
All right, we spent like 11 grand today, so our P&L is going to be off. And by off, I mean off the charts. All right, we're... God, that was dumb. We're going to wrap it up here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like. If you have any comments, suggestions, throw them in the comment section below. And of course, if you enjoyed this and you haven't subscribed, consider clicking that good old subscribe button on YouTube to let you know when I get fresh content out. All that being said, I'll see you next time. <laughs>